Wait, how old was I when I got It's it's not it's so This doesn't look like game night. It kind of is. Ella, we've let this go on long enough. Couldn't we have just sent her an email? This is awkward. Can someone please just tell me what is going on? It's... it's an intervention. Kind of. What do we end up calling this thing? It's an imagivention. So this is about Amy? Is Amy here in this room? Why would I bring Amy to game night? None of you could see her anyway. That's why we called it a game night. You're too old for this, Ella. Even Kaylee hasn't done the imaginary friend thing in how long? Two years. That's not fair. Everybody is different. I don't need an imaginary friend intervention. Kids are only supposed to have imaginary friends for so long. I know it can be hard to let go, but to be free from someone no one else can see, it's... It's a relief. Ella, we were supposed to play pirates and unicorns. Why are you in a room with all these empty chairs? Hold, hold on. Did Amy just get here? Amy, you're not welcome here. Hey, stop that. She can't hear you anyway. No, but she can hear you. So now she knows you're busy. Or crazy. Pirates and unicorns is tomorrow. How do you play pirates and unicorns? I don't know. Sounds kind of fun. Oh, I get it. You have imaginary friends that I can't see. So what happens if I do this? Amy, don't! Oh! Oh, shit! Oh, get her out of here right now! Whoa! Ella? Please talk to her! Get her under control! Amy! Are you mad? I thought we were playing pretend. Did I do something wrong? I just... Your imagination can get a little wild. I, I thought imagination was a good thing. It is. It is. I wouldn't have my best friend without imagination. The people in that room, they think imaginary and real friends are just a kid thing. But I am a kid. I know. It's just... I've been doing this for a lot longer than normal. Just because you grow up doesn't mean you have to stop imagining. Well, is she gone? Do you know what happens to imaginary friends when their humans let them go? No, what? They become scared. They can't think for themselves and they become afraid of everyone who can still dream. I'm real to that little girl and it's my job to protect her imagination no matter what. Just because you stop playing with your kids doesn't mean I have to abandon mine. I'm not ashamed to be Amy's imaginary friend, and maybe it's time for all of you to actually have a real game night instead of forcing everyone to be like you. Are we still friends? Is the unicorn the mortal enemy of the pirates?